New Superman and the Justice League of China issue 23 saw the newly christened Dragon Son fulfill his mission and begin the biblical flood of North Korea. The boy inside Dragon Son can't bring himself to commit the genocide however, but it makes no difference to Superman, who, still affected by All Yang's spirit, intends to kill him. Only Avery Ho can save Keenan from himself, getting him to revert to good old Keenan. But that's not all, as the Superman is now under arrest by the Green Lanterns of China. Batman meanwhile teams up with his villainous sister Alpaca to escape the crab shell and reunite with the Flash, only to find Alpaca has mysteriously disappeared. In North Korea, Dragon Sun is attacking the oncoming North Korean army and the Green Lanterns, who thanks to their quick trigger fingers blow up Dragon Sun's sword, unleashing a huge torrent of ancient waters on to the settlements below. This causes the heroes to break off the attack and to try and save as many civilians as possible inside the danger zone, but the Lantern and stay with the Dragon Sun, unconcerned of the helpless civilians. Keenan meanwhile taps into his new powers, allowing him to free himself from the lantern cell and making him a ghost-like being who takes out the lanterns with a flick of his fingers. The surprise attack gives the Dragon Sun enough time to fight his father's spirit, sucking back all of the ancient waters inside of him. In the aftermath, Dragon Sun joins the Justice League of China and Batman points his sister down a more heroic path. Keenan meanwhile talks with his his spirit guides, finding that the white version of him was his out of balance self in the favour of All Yang, while the ghost like form he took was from his master I Ching, and because of that he learns he now has balance. He also learns that because now he can go into the ghost realm, he can rescue his master I Ching from the realm of ghosts. New Superman and the Justice League of China issue 23 continues to deliver a fun, action packed and different take on familiar character archetypes, in this case the debut story of the quote-unquote Aquaman of North Korea. It's great that we have here what are essentially legacy characters of Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, Flash, but they are allowed to make the mantles their own and put their own spins on it and have their own really unique stories. It's not, you know, this Superman has to fight Lex Luthor every other time or this Flash has to verse a reverse Flash. They have their own unique stories imbued in Asian culture and I think that's really cool. What's even better is Keenan again learnt more about his powers and even learnt a new pretty OP power which will allow him to rescue his master and possibly lead to more exciting powers for the hero to discover. I'm going to give this issue a 9.5 out of 10. Hey everyone, thanks for watching my newest video. If you enjoyed it, you might also like to check out my other reviews here on my channel. You can also follow me on various social media platforms like Twitter by searching Matt underscore FOS, or even join the Comic Multiverse Discord server and chat with other comic book fans, including myself and Joel from Cape Joel. Want cheap comics and trades? Head over to the book depository with the link in the description to get the cheapest trades and comics around, along with free shipping anywhere in the world. Until next time, this has been Matt of the Fortress of Solitude, thank you so much for watching.